Hello, this is Nikki for my nine week update uh, for my second pregnancy. Um, this week has been pretty similar to the previous weeks. I've still been really tired. Um, I've still uh, had pretty bad nausea. Um, it's probably been, I don't know, it just seems to be getting worse and worse. Like, it'll be all day nausea. You know, there'd be parts of the day where it's not so bad, but then parts of the day where it's just really terrible and I don't even feel like eating. Um, I still do, but just kind of small amounts. Apart from anything else, I can't fit anything more than small amounts in. Um, and my uterus isn't even taking up all that much space yet. <laughs> um, I have also been getting hot flushes, which I've also had the previous weeks, just forgot to mention it. Um, so like, you know, one moment I'm just normal temperature, whatever, and then all of a sudden I'm just, oh, I'm so hot. <sighs> and I need to take off layers or whatever. Um, and sometimes also, like, I'll just be really cold, but m more often it's hot flushes. Um, yeah, so it's like my body is having trouble regulating the temperature or something. Um, I've up until probably nine weeks, I didn't really like my breasts weren't really tender or anything, like they were in the first pregnancy, um, like even from four or five weeks. Um, but yeah, starting from nine weeks, that has uh, begun a little bit. Um, not like fully hurting or anything but I can notice it now um, I'm still breastfeeding as well so I don't know if that's got anything to do with it or um, whether it's got nothing to do with it but yeah um, I've a lot of women like will have troubles with constipation apparently in um, pregnancy I've never had that. I occasionally have the opposite problem, um, but no real, like, no constipation issues or anything. Um, cravings? Not really. Like, I still haven't had any cravings particularly. Um, again, at this stage, it's still, you know, if I can think of anything that I want to eat, then that's great. <laughs> um, in terms of um, the sex of the baby, I I am thinking it, that it's a boy. Um, it's it's not as strong a feeling as it was where with Alara when I thought that she was a girl. But I don't know. I'm still thinking boy. I mean, I'm keeping my mind open to the fact that it yet still could possibly be a girl. But um, I guess one of the main reasons, and but I was I still thought boy even before I had this confirmed, um, was the with the timing of the um, ovulation and, and conception and, and all that. Um, when my doctor confirmed that the dates that I had thought were correct, um, then uh, yeah the. Um, I don't know, just like the dates point more to, to boy than to girl. Um, but yeah, even before I had that confirmed, I don't know, I just thought, mm, I'm thinking boy. I don't know, we'll see. I still haven't decided whether I'm actually going to find out um, at 16 weeks. Um, I, can't, I really like the idea of having a surprise, but I don't know if I'm going to be patient enough. And then the other thing is I'm going to Australia um, at Christmas time and it might be nice to, you know, be able to do some shopping down there with my mum or, um, but yeah, I don't know. I probably will find out, but I'm not 100% sure yet. Um, I think that's all I have to mention. Yep. Alright, so I'll see you for uh, my 10-week pregnancy update. Bye.